that Lennon thing was really, really difficult. It was reedy. I mean, everybody went so over the top, you know, in a kind, in 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 what I thought was like, um, almost like vultures and things, you know, like grave robbers or something. It, the whole thing just I thought became very, it became tasteless, really, sort of pursuing the corpse, and. Uh, I was dragged out of bed by Radio 4, made it, said a few inappropriate words on the Today programme and then wouldn't do anymore because after that I then got, I mean, again, literally dozens of phone calls from radio stations and even TV stations. I mean, I was supposed to nationwide wanted me to go down there and eulogise and so on. And it just seemed to me not the right thing to do at all. The professional mourner is not a role that I was really very interested in being cast in. Also, I mean, I hadn't actually known Lennon very well. I mean, I'd only known him for about six or nine months or something like that. But, of course, they don't really care. It's all the extraordinary thing about programmes like Nationwide is that it doesn't matter for what you say as long as you can keep saying it, you know what I mean? It doesn't matter if you t say absolutely nothing at all. It's your ability to keep rabbiting away that, it, that they're interested in. Yeah, and Reedy really did, is, went up well over the top and sort of abandoned all of his programme and played two and a half hours of... John Lennon records, and then said at the end of his program, I expect Peely's going to be playing more after the news, which of course I wasn't, well, I, I said, well, you know, no, I'm not.